told me that love was only in the movies that don't exist in real life these days. No, but you showed me if I only just find the faith I need to believe. Anything is possible if you want it bad enough. No, the sky ain't too high. Test your limits. Feel unstoppable, incredible. Almost there, I can see I'm so ready. Hey, Ace hey, Family! Welcome back to our channel, guys. What's going on? Everybody, hey, I see you doing it. Huh? So, if you are new to this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and join the family. They should join the family, huh? Yeah. yeah. So before we get into today's video, we just want to say that there is exactly one week left until the Ace Family Basketball Charity event. Six days Six left. Six days left. Six days. Which also means that this is going to be the last week that our jerseys are going to be on sale. Guys, last week that these jerseys, these Ace Family jerseys will be on sale. So Kath and I decided that if you get an Ace Family jersey with your purchase, you will get a free Ace Family family pop socket a lot of you guys have been requesting for us to do a, a pop socket for the longest time so we decided to just give you guys one with the purchase of a jersey which is really cool and this is only gonna last for the next couple of days oh Elle wants to show you her ace family bear oh you love it oh <laughs> you love it <laughs> show them what it looks like wow you're throwing it around earlier <laughs> you like it Oi. Careful. Oh, oh, okay, oh, oh, okay. So now the moment that I'm sure you all have been waiting for us to talk about. Non-stop, it's been like the question. So. All we have to say is. Stop. Stop it. This was hers. She's no longer with us. I just want to say that we were extremely overwhelmed when we woke up to a dog literally at our front door. What the hell? I am so confused. Guys, um, is there cameras around here? Am I getting pranked right now? The note says they left a puppy here for L, for us, right? But, guys, there's no puppy here. Where is the puppy? Oh, shit. Oh, my God. She's a baby. Oh, my God. She's a baby. Who had her? The neighbor. It was the craziest thing. I, I probably... Haven't been that stressed in a long time for the for the past couple of days. I just had so much stress because I obviously didn't expect this to happen. And at the end of the day, like our biggest concern was that the dog would end up with a good family in a good home. And so that was probably like my biggest stress. Um, and then obviously Elle loving the dog. She was she got really close to her in the last couple of days. Right, baby. <laughs> So we decided together, Austin and I, we had a lot of time to think. She spent the night and uh, we got her a crate and food and all that. So I think you guys saw what we got her for that day. All right, so I think I got enough stuff. Jeez. We got everything. And um, basically, we had our families and our friends and everyone just kind of give us advice on what to do. I really wanted to keep her and we kept going back and forth like should we keep her should we not keep her and so your dad actually made a good point she's gonna grow up and she's gonna have a lot a lot of shedding and Austin is really allergic and I know a lot of you guys mentioned in the comments that there are things that you can do like an allergy shot for Austin no. <laughs> or like or like bathing the dog in like a certain uh, allergy shampoo so we read a lot about it and we did a lot of research we saw a lot of your comments we asked her family our friends and basically all of those things aren't really good for Austin or the dog and um, not only is he allergic but the shedding would be like all over the house and just it's just not the dog we were looking for 
And the right time. And the right time. I know we really wanted to see Zeus, who was actually pretty similar to the dog that we got at our doorstep, but I don't think it's the I don't think it's meant to be. And so it's we had to make this hard ass decision last night. As you all know, we have a lot going on. Obviously, Elle's growing up. She's a lot to handle herself. You're a lot to handle, huh? Yeah, she is, she admits it. She's a handful. And we also have another little princess on the way. She'll be here in the next four months. So really, if we were to keep the dog, we would have three kids. So to answer all of your questions, we did not keep the Husky. As a matter of fact, before we made a final decision, we contacted the owner and we got a chance to talk to her on the phone because we wanted to make sure that if we decided not to keep the dog, that the dog did have a home to go to and it was gonna be taken care of. And she that was did our say, concern. yeah, that was our biggest concern. And so she did say that if we decided not to keep the dog, that she had someone in mind. It was actually a family member that she said would be able to take care of the dog. So that made us feel really good, and I feel like that kind of sealed our decision. Yeah, um, it made it so much easier. Yeah. So once we knew that, she came to the house and took her away. We're good. And we have a clip of that. You want you want me to roll the clip of the dog leaving? Okay. We're gonna roll the clip for you guys. This was last night when the dog left. Elle got to say goodbye. Here it is. Roll it. Girls, Nala's mommy is here. Oh, this is so sad. Oh, uh, Ali. Is that <laughs> Nala's stuff? Yeah, huh, bro? Yeah. She's going bye bye. She's going bye bye. Oh my gosh. Wait, isn't that her sister? Look, bro. Oh, we, we got Ryan. We got. We got Ryan in the drawers. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Hey, don't get. Don't get that. Oh, look. They're united. Wait, is this the one that we had? Or this is the one? Which was the one? Oh my God. Which one was the one? This one. This, this one. This one's Nala. So this was. So she really missed her. Oh, they're sisters. Oh, wow. you you can that can't be separated. Each other. No, yeah, they can't, can't be separated. Be separated. Look at the bond. It's like twin flames. It's time to say goodbye, guys. <laughs> hey, buddy. Ali, Ali's known Nala for what? Like an hour? <laughs> an hour. And I was already in love, guys. Oh, you want to put it in their car for them? Thank you, bro. The doggy's going back to her mama, okay? Aww. Okay? Aww. You going to be okay? You, you like your ice cream? Like ice Guys, we tried to distract her with her ice cream, yeah, so she didn't get it. sad. Were, um, Nala's happy, and bro. And they, you know, they She's happy. <laughs> oh, Nala's back. Nala, baby, this just lets us know that Nala wasn't happy with us. <laughs> she didn't like us. No, she did, bro. Oh, Nala wasn't meant to be with us. Say bye. Say bye, L. Bye, dog. She said. Oh. <laughs> bye, princess. Oh, oh, bye. <laughs> Say thank you for everything, doggy. Say bye. I'm just sad looking at them go. Bye. <laughs> We're all sad. We're gonna keep it. You guys sad? Yeah. I'm so sad. The key, the key dog. Bye. bye. Oh my gosh. Drive safe. So sad. Nala. I'll always remember you! Alright guys, so I know that was a little bit sad, but let's continue to be happy, <laughs> be positive, move forward, and continue on with, with today's video. I can't believe this even happened to us. I know. Ace Family, before we continue on with today's video, I'm gonna need all of you to give this video a thumbs up right now to wish the Husky the best of luck. Hashtag good luck Husky. Yes. All right, Ace Family, so Ryan and I are super excited right now because we just got back our rat mobiles. But we're missing something. There's three bikes and only two of us. If you guys know what we're missing, just comment down below. As you all can see, the rat gang isn't complete. We are missing the, the tea. tea. And the tea has been gone for a couple months now. He's wiped up now. Ace fam, let me need all of you to comment on his social media right now. Spam him, please. If you don't know what we're talking about, we're talking about Trey. <laughs> comment on all his social media, Ace fam. I need you to go just spam his shit. And tell him to come back to at least visit us. At least visit. But as of right now, the only thing we could do is go to our secret spot to clear our minds. And I think that we should show them where Ace Family, we usually go. We're about to give y'all a sneak little peek of our secret spot. Y'all ready? You trying to race? What? You want to race over there? You 
want to race? You want to race? Are you down? This is Ryan and I's getaway place. This place literally is the place you come to to like think about your dreams, think about your visions, and bro, we, we're here too often, honestly. <laughs> Guys, it's actually windy as hell up here. I'm not sure if you can hear me, but we gotta get back to the house so we can close out today's video. Where's Ryan? What? Stop! Don't interrupt me. Dame tu cosita. Bebe, please tell me you have a post on vacation shout out person today. I do actually. Okay, so today's post on vacation shout out goes to Jocelyn Gaspar. So hey, shout out, to you, shout out to you, girl. Thank you so much for being part of the Ace Family. You already know. We love you. Whoever else would like a post notification shout out, you should already know what to do. Subscribe to the Ace Family. Hit that subscribe button. Turn on our post notifications. Hit that bell button. And once you do those two things, all you gotta do is comment. Done. <laughs> Hey, what are you doing? I'm not lying. <laughs> so like, comment, share, and subscribe. And like me and my beautiful family always say, Elle's butt naked right now, so we're not putting her in the frame. But she's here. Like we always say, we'll be back with more videos. Peace.